So there's a couple of things I'm thinking about chocolate bars, chocolate bars in England. First thing I'm thinking is that um, why did Marathon change its name to Snickers? What was wrong with the name Marathon? I don't know why. It must have been some financial reason. Another thing I'm wondering is um, how can every Mars bar be the same? How can it taste exactly the same? How is it possible to manufacture a food product the same every time? It, does, it seems to me it doesn't matter if you change ingredients and you, you're careful with your ingredients and your methodology. I just don't understand how every mask can be identical pretty much. It's incredible. Another thing I'm wondering is how does money work? I realise that I don't actually understand how and why money works. Why can I give a £20 note to someone and it means I can buy something physical with it? Why does this note mean anything? And my initial thinking is that the reason the money means something is because we choose to accept it as meaning something. It doesn't have any value independently. We just assume it has value and so we respect it and honour it. And I realise now that's why it says on a £20 note or whatever I promise to pay the bearer the sum of £20. I realise that money is a promise to give someone something real for a piece of paper. It's strange how I never appreciated before that money was just a promise and that we choose to respect it. I'm thinking we don't need to respect it and we could dishonour it and how would there be a consequence? I don't understand why that promise means anything or why it should be honoured. Honored. Why does money have any meaning? Do you see what I mean?